Hi there, Johnny here from johnnylipsonstudios.co.uk and in this video and in the next several videos in this Studio One 4.5 series, we are going to be looking at two different features in each video. So in this episode, we are going to be looking at the customization options of the console uh, mix of you and how you can customize the look of your channels and also we're going to be looking at the new metering options which are extremely cool and uh, have been very highly sought after and voted up in um, the feature request forum over at answers.personas.com so let's take a look at those so uh, if we go over to the wrench here this uh, whole area has been vastly reorganized and looks a lot better and there's a whole bunch of new options so um, the group assignment is one option down here and that that group assignment is all of these here um, in uh, my first episode of this series I kind of showed this in a little uh, just a little bit but essentially that's the grouping option there so you can have that showing or you can have it hidden um, you can also show and hide the input controls, which are the new uh, controls at the top here, the um, gain and the polarity reverse uh, buttons. You can turn those on and off. And of course, you, you've always got the, the grouping options here, the keeping the effects channels or the buses or the VSAs to the right, preserving the order of channels with folder track. All of those kind of um, uh, have come with previous versions or uh, audio device controls if you have um, an interface that has DSP or something like that like or some kind of controls within Studio One like the Studio 192 for example has a whole bunch of controls that, that appear here uh, and you can show and hide those as well which is all very cool and of course the channel notes from 4.0 and VCA connections also the IO connections you can um, show and hide those as well so um, you know you might find that instead of having to drag them up you can just make sure that this button here is checked or not checked as the case may be whichever you choose okay so that's those options there so you can um, customize how you want it to look you can have it looking exactly like it used to in 4.1 or you can have the all of the new options available to you okay so that's those let's take a look at the metering options now one of the most uh, highly voted up requests was to have pre-fader metering and also peak and RMS metering as well now we have those now which is very cool so if you hover your mouse inside one of the uh, meters here and you right click these are the options that now appear. So you have peak, peak RMS, peak hold, and you can choose the hold length. If you go for peak hold, you can choose how long it holds for, a couple of seconds, 15 seconds, or just infinity. And of course, pre-fader metering, which is um, very, very cool. So when you're recording um, and you want to see what uh, your gain level is going in before it hits the fader, you can now show that. And it's very very cool um, so let's have a look at some of those let's play the track and we will um, have a look at some of these options how they look <laughs> So that's how they look now or how they have looked historically so let's go and choose peak RMS and now um, historically you've only ever had this showing up on the main output here but now you have um, the RMS lines appearing in each of the channels which is very cool and you can change the RMS length as well so you can have it um, 0.6 of a second, 1.6 or 3 seconds and you can change the peak hold and the hold length as I said earlier. Now let's take a look at pre-fader ok 
Okay, so there you go. So those are the new um, options, and you can certainly try those out to your heart's content. See, you can actually do both. You can do peak RMS and the pre fader metering, which is very handy. So um, check those out. <clears throat> Excuse me. Check those out and uh, check out the customizations that you can now do on, on your channels and uh, enjoy them, and I will see you on the next video. Bye for now.